We're here at the HP Technology uh, uh, Exhibition, the uh, Tech Forum uh, in Las Vegas, and we've come across a really interesting exhibit from a company called Norin, N-O-R-E-N. Will, what have we got laid out here? We have a, a bunch of heat pipes. Heat pipes are a thermally conductive way of moving heat. And um, so basically customers come to us, they need some sort of thermal management solution, be it at the chip level or the way up to large enclosures. And we manufacture everything on site. Um, and a heat pipe, basically all it is is a copper metal tube. It's got a wick on the inside and then uh, it's got a working fluid. So it's a phase change. So this is, this is the wick and... Uh... Yep, you have your cop metal tube, uh, the wicking structure, and then the fluid inside, and it's a phase change. So um, it's really, it's almost a thousand times the thermal conductivity of copper. So really efficient, quick way of moving heat. So, so who are your customers for, for this? Um, it could be anyone from a manufacturer who's coming up with a new design and they're worried about the thermal issues, or an end user who's uh, going with a, a rack mount enclosure and they're putting just way too much heat in and they're not comfortable with the, what they're running it at. So anyone and everyone almost. Is this determined empirically or is it modeled in some way in your design? Um, over 40 years we've developed our own way of, of modeling. Um, so we do all of our in-house, we'll help you out. Um, or if you have a, a custom design that you, you think will work for you, we're more than happy to just be a manufacturer for you also. So. Oh, okay, so what's this demo that you've got to set up here towards so the end. The demo is, is we, we have a, a cold bucket and we have a hot bucket, the hot water. So we have our, anyone that comes by and we'll take one of the pipes and put it in the hot water for about 30 seconds. They'll hold on to it and you can feel that, that heat pulsate up. And uh, within that 30 seconds, it gets almost to the what, temperature of the hot water. Okay. And then you drop it back into the cold and it's even quicker to cool back down. So, so which uh, of all the form factors that you have here, which is the most difficult from a fabrication standpoint? Um, most difficult, we uh, definitely flatten the heat pipe so we can get it as small as about two millimeters thin. And um, these, these hard bends are also probably the hardest to make in the, the same plane almost is what we like to call them, same plane bends. So taking a flat heat pipe and, and, and bending it along that way. Yeah. It, it's always interesting to find things that, that are, are so good that they blend into the background and you're not conscious of it. Where, where do people go to find more information about your product and technology? Our, our best way is just to go to our website. It's a, a great website if you need sizing or anything like that. And also just to call us, you know, ask questions, and we're more than happy to help and come by and, and let, see what we can help you out with. Well, there you are, the uh, uh, information on thermal management issues from uh, Norton. Uh, thanks very much, Will. Have, have a good show.